Welcome to Monotech. Today we're going to retrofit an LCD into a PanelView 1200 monochrome version. Uh, as you can see, the screen is pretty burnt in and the, the monitor is actually now defective. So we're going to, the video, to do this whole thing, it'll take about a half an hour, so we're going to cut in and out on the different sections uh, and talk through and walk through the different parts. Okay, so I removed a whole bunch of screws. We got screws on the sides, two screws on the bottom, screws on the back, and then we removed the ground strap that over there, the computer board. This is your Allen Bradley computer board. Um, and what we're going to do, it's still, the cover's still stuck on there. There's a couple bolts that are still attached, so we're gonna remove those as well. Uh, so you need your flat, big flat screwdriver. And uh, actually, first we're gonna remove our cables. The socket you need is, is either a 3 8 or 9 millimeters, both of them will work. Now with the CRT part, um, the only safety issues is you're, you're concerned is the anode lead here. Um, if this monitor has been on the last uh, 24 hours, you need to discharge it and you discharge it by using two screwdrivers. You basically crisscross your screwdrivers and use a flat screwdriver to get in there and that discharges it. Uh, it just on the monochrome monitors, it maintains the charge. The color monitor doesn't keep the charge. Uh, the other thing you want to, you, you don't want to do is once this tube comes out of the frame, you don't want to. You have to make sure you don't drop it because it's a uh, it's a vacuum sealed tube, so glass shatters everywhere. Uh, it implodes and explodes, so you have to be careful of that. Um, another thing is when you're taking it apart, I tend not to cut cables because. Uh, just in case something has to, you have to put things back together. Um, you don't want to be in that position where you, all of your cables have been cut. <clears throat> so we're gonna loosen these off. Loosen these off, that off, that off. Loosen off these. So that these. One of those chemicals that your body doesn't get rid of. Take our monitor. Tops here, tops there. Need to move, take this board off. Putting it back together.
You can't get them backwards because you can't flip them around. So one goes in one and the other one goes in the other. You can see the two little hooks popping through. Once the hooks are there, you push it down. Monotech provides a video adapter cable. video plug plugs into the monitor. So at this point in time it might be a good idea to test it before you put assemble everything. Um, this has a computer built in so the computer's secure, the power supply is secure, the monitor's secure. Um, if you hold this up here you'll see line neutral ground is are these three and you just put your plugs in there accordingly and you can test it and run it make sure it works and once you're happy with that keep putting the rest of the screws in. When you're putting the back cover on, sometimes it's easier to semi put the screws in and then go around and tighten them afterwards because if, you, if it's too far off, it makes the last one really difficult to put in. Now we have the LCD retrofitted inside. It's nice close to the screen. Uh, our CRT is sitting here, and our driver board for the CRT is right here as well. And there's four screws left over because those will help the board in, which we don't need anymore. And we remove this uh, very sticky foam that's not required. And that's it. Uh, if you have any questions, go to www.monotech.com. Contact us through email or phone. Thank you.